W.G. Grace wouldn't have believed it. Even Ted Dexter would have raised an eyebrow. Australian women taking the field at the Oval, in a test match too. England openers Driscoll and Elledge come out as to the man of all. You'll forgive our not calling the players Miss or Mrs. It's a man's game. But anyone who thinks cricket is outside the range of the fair sex has another thing coming. How's this for a throw? As smartly as a county player, Amos saves the boundary. Victor and bowling to Elledge. The England girls in good form, well on the way to her half century. Thompson on at the gasworks end. Elledge gets a single, and that's her 50. Against knee, England's captain, Miss Duggan, pushes the score along and looks well set. By the way, this is the third and last match of the series. The first two were drawn, so this is England's last chance to regain the Ashes. Marvel now gets hey-ho LBW. Ladies, LBW is when a girl uses her legs to stop the ball hitting those three sticks behind her. England are doing well. 230 for seven, despite some fine bowling by Kutcher, whose fifth victim is Pilling, clean bowl. But of course, the feat of the day is the century scored by Miss Duggan. The captain carries her bat for 101 and declares the innings at 254. Congratulations to her and to England on a fine start. Jolly cricket bats.